6'2", 200-pound senior running back who had circled out of the backfield. That's Wood in motion. Pressure, and he just throws it away, and that's going to be an illegal dumping of the ball, and the flag is thrown. Cortez threw that one away, and then there's a late hit after the fact. We may have offsetting infractions here. Well, I think San Pedro would take it because otherwise it's going to be intentional grounding. They're going to lose the yardage and the down. You know, the Gaucho's mission is to put a lot of pressure on this young quarterback, Jimmy Cortez. Remember also, he's a left-hander, so when he's rolling and chased to his right side, he can't get the ball away. There's Tim Tucker, who came in last week and really fortified the defense. They moved him over to defense, and he played stout football. He was terrific in the victory over Banning. They're the only team to beat Banning this year. They won that game 31-18. Well, the first penalty has been indicated. That was the illegal forward pass here thrown by quarterback Cortez when he just grounded the ball. Oh, I can see why the flag was thrown, but that was a pretty good pop. Had to feel bad there for Joey Chavez, who really took that one and, and took it hard. So you're going to have a case where they'll go one way, then probably turn around and go back the other way. That's the first one. That's the foul for... No, that's the personal foul on Narbonne if they moved it out to the 45-yard line. So after all that, it'll still be second down and 15. Well, the intentional grounding is a spot foul, so the penalties aren't the same distance in yardage. Whoops. Corey Vine started before everyone else for San Pedro. And again, they're working with that second team quarterback, so it's a little bit different for everybody. And then you add into it, Dave, the fact that they didn't have an opportunity to practice for three days. Just not easy to execute today. That's why you're going to have a movement like that. Second down and 20. Pirates back at their 40-yard line. And they'll run the football with Deguchi, and he has five yards. Jojo Deguchi, they like him. He's a 5'865 pound junior. Number 12 is very quick. Well, that run should put Deguchi over 200 yards on the ground this year. Had 196 coming into the night. Does a good job of protecting the ball, not getting it knocked away when he runs into Tim Tucker's helmet. Number 31 got a, a good lick on it. Right, Tim Tucker is an impressive looking football player. Third down and 15. Play fake. Open receiver. Ahmad Wood. First down to the 24 yard line. 29 yards and after the play another flag. But that was another strong throw by quarterback Jimmy Cortez. Cortez very poised in the pocket. You see the play sort of breaks down. I'm not sure if that was supposed to be a play fake. It didn't fool anybody, but he does a good job of rolling out and gets a lot of steam on this throw. And hey, memo to Narbon. He's left-handed. You got to cover that side of the field. 90 seconds left of the first quarter. Gauchos trying to protect an 8-0 lead, but the Pirates are moving the football. Nice looking drive and San Pedro for the first time uh, getting the ball in the offensive flow to Ahmad Wood. That's a good idea. Well, both teams jittery on their first offensive series, but they're getting into the rhythm of the game now. As you see the discussion continuing and 